Today I want to tell you about someone very close to my heart. This is my brother Steven. He may look a bit different to you. That's because he has down syndrome. You may know that when one has down syndrome, certain aspects of their growth and development are slowed down. But still, they are great to be with like my brother Steven. When Steven was born, my parents found out that he was going to be special throughout his life and would need more support and care. He was always cheerful and smiling and though a bit late grew up like any other baby He was so very happy and thrilled when I was born because now he had someone to play with all the time <laughs> We grew up together and enjoyed each other's company as we explored the many things this world has to offer. Steven is now 15 years old. His days are almost like that of any other child around his age. He wakes up in the morning and gets set to go to school. He attends a school where he has other friends who have special needs. He learns to read and write. Joins in various activities including cultural programs. He even wins many prizes and awards in competitions he takes part in. He likes to copy what I do and often waits for me to join him for fun. He loves playing on the iPod, iPad and computer. His favorite TV characters are Mr Bean and Barney. He can spend hours just watching them on the internet while singing or dancing in front of the TV. He can be a bit stubborn when we ask him to play with my younger brother and me outside the house. He's good at bowling in cricket. He often gets my father, my younger brother and me out with his unique delivery. He really gets happy and excited when he does that. The best quality about him is that he's so jovial. He jokes, laughs and smiles most of the time. Smallest of things can get him to burst out laughing. His laugh and smile are so contagious that anyone with him or in the room will certainly start laughing too. When Steven returns from school, he has a smile on his face and is all excited to tell us about his day at school. He's also learning to make his real nice pictures, something he really enjoys doing. Steven is really affectionate. He loves everyone and does not hate anyone. His anger or disappointment with anyone will only last for a few seconds, after which he's laughing and giggling all over again. After his characteristic hug me dialogue, he's so caring that if my younger brother or I get hurt, he comes and tries to ease our pains. He rubs his hand over our hurting parts and says sorry. Still really has a creative mind. 
His ideas are really creative and odd. Some of his ideas even work. But what I know is that Steven feels lonely at times. Beyond our family, grandparents and his mates in school, he does not have any friends. Some children and their parents find it difficult to accept a child with special needs to their circles. They don't realize that he is also another regular child who loves to have friends. He is another child who has feelings and emotions and desires. Though he is such a lovable boy, not everyone realizes this. They see his disabilities and not the person with him. And God does not differentiate because of disability. We all love to have friends and so does my brother Steven. I am proud of him and will always be his greatest friend. What about you? Will you be his friend? Will you make friends with other children who have special needs? Will you? Will you? Will you?